welcome back to my wash and go series if you are new here and if you have not seen any of my wash and go videos i will leave the playlist down below so you can check them out after this video so um i've used this gel before but i haven't used it in a while i've used it when i had my twa and i did not start my natural hair journey youtube channel until i hit like a year or so so i haven't used this since like i big chopped but the gel that i will be using today for my wash and go is the aunt jackie's uh flexi recipes don't shrink flexi elongating curly gel oh that's a mouthful so yeah um, so I have made my own flaxseed gel before that is also in my wash and go playlist. If it's not, I'll also link that video down below on how I made the flaxseed gel and everything like that. But, um, yeah, we're just going to get right into this video. Um, the cream that I'm going to be using to pair with this is the Shea Moisture's Coconut Hibiscus curling smoothie and if you guys know and if you are new here this is my favorite gel because it's just my favorite gel so i'm um, these two do mix together so i'm hopefully won't experience any type of uh white cast or flaking and stuff like that but um if you haven't used this gel before, we're just going to open it up and I'm just going to show you what the gel looks like. So, it's kind of more jelly than um, like an actual gel. It's clear and that's how thick it is and whatnot. It smells like, oh, it smells like perfumish e. I really haven't used this in a while. I'm gonna hop right into the video and um, yeah. So if you're new here, typically I show you guys how the gel looks on the first section and everything like that. So I'm just gonna put my hair in the four sections. Um, I'll list what I use to wash my hair with down in the description. It's actually uh, it's actually a video because I did a video on a product review and it's going to be up before this video. So um, I'll leave that video down below as well. That's too much hair in that section. Go up there. Okay. So yeah, if you used this gel before, let me know down in the comment section how you used it. If you used it with a braid out and twist out. Finger corals, wash and go, whatever you use it for, let me know down below. Um, if there's any other gels that you guys want me to try for my wash and go series that I have not tried already, leave those gels down below as well. My hair is kind of dry for being in that t-shirt too long. Hello, what's going on? All right, so first thing we gonna do is resaturate my hair with some warm water. Because it is dry. Each book. Ooh, okay. Then I'm just gonna add a little bit of my curling enhancing smoothie. About that much. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but y'all gonna get it anyway. Take a little bit more because my hair feel a little bit still dry. And because I love this shit, this shit is like cracked on my hair, y'all. I'm telling y'all. 
Like if this is not in my hair, my hair will not stay moisturized for like a couple of days. Like when I have this in my hair, my hair stays moisturized for like three days max without me having to re-moisturize my hair. Alright, and I'm just going to add just a little bit more water to my hair. Because I like my hair so it soaks and wets. And I'm gonna take about this much of the gel. Cause knowing me, I'm gonna add more. Ooh. embarrassing me hair oh doing it again I see okay that's how we rocking today got it got it all right so now I'm gonna add some more gel to my roots because my roots are the most stubbornest part of my hair Just gonna add a little bit more to the ends, like literally a little bit, like that much left. Left, Jesus, about that much, just to my ends. Okay, so then once I apply all the products to my hair, sometimes I like to just take my brush and try to clump my hair together at the bottom. But I usually do it with my dimming brush. But I had to throw my dimming brush away because it wasn't cooperating with me no more. So, and that brush didn't work. So now I gotta put more gel in my hair. Okay, so now I'm just going to continue with the rest of my hair and you guys are just going to watch. Honey, I'm perfect in. What does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Oh, oh. Can we switch up all the rules And imagine a utopia Darling, I'm just so fed up with these expectations They weigh me down My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head I wanna live inside the upside down For a minute and pretend Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa It's overrated. 
These expectations, they gave way and me down My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head I'm gonna live inside the upside down For a minute and pretend Honey, I'm a perfect ten Whoa Honey, I'm a perfect ten Whoa And if I say it enough It gets ingrained in my head And I start Does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Ooh, ooh. Can we switch up all the rules? And imagine a utopia but Darling, I'm just so fed up with these expectations They can weigh me down My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head I'm gonna live inside the upside down For a minute and pretend Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa Honey, I'm a perfect ten, whoa, whoa And if I say it enough, it gets ingrained in my head And I start to see Honey, I'm a perfect ten why I didn't use this gel anymore once my hair got a little bit longer but we gonna see once it dries because I don't like to say anything until my hair dries so I'm gonna let my hair air dry and I'll come back on camera to show you guys the results whenever it dries all right so this is the next day and my hair isn't dried. It's not dry. It's like maybe 75% dry. But um this is what my curls are looking like. <laughs> Excuse me. Um I didn't break the gel cast or anything, so my hair still looks like really clumped together and everything. Um, did it elongate my curls? I will say yes and no because um, my hair is getting longer so I'm thinking this is just the length that my wash and go is going to be since my hair is getting longer but um, I can say yes because like usually my hair is like really shrunken it really shrinks up when I do wash and goes with like other gels so I think you know I think it elongated my curls just a tad bit just a tad bit but it's only because I have to use so much for my hair because it's such a light gel so like if you have like a thinner hair than me then it'll probably elongate your curls a little bit more but because I have really thick hair I use I have to use a lot of gel <clears throat> and I think that's what it says in the, in the directions if I'm not mistaken stomach while we growing we just ate but um I have no white residue or like no flakes because the products do mash together. I do have a video on product uh, compatibility and I'll leave that down below so you can, so you guys can know how to check to see if your creams and your gels are going to mix for the summertime. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video um don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you are not already comment down any gel and cream combinations that you want me to try um for my wash and go series and don't forget to follow me on all social media platforms so you can know when i'm uploading and when i'm uploading and yeah that's pretty much it i will catch you guys 
in my next video. Bye, guys.